Hey guys, this is here Conan Coral with another LEGO technique. Um, if you've been playing with LEGO for a while, you've probably noticed that the studs on the bricks go into the bottom of the other bricks, like so. Doop. If you've been playing with LEGO for more than a while, you may have even developed techniques like using the Ring of Power to connect two studs together. But today, we're going to show how studs can actually connect to studs of their own accord, just using the clutch power and the distance between them. So you'll need to start with a 2x2, two two, anything really, it can be a brick or a plate, and four Travis bricks. So taking the four Travis bricks, we're just going to connect them together really quick in like a spiral or a circle, and that will give us that sort of shape. Uh, this sort of shape is actually pretty annoying in general, because you can see that it's not a 2x2 two two on top and on the sides it's not a 2x1 so connecting to that is really difficult unless you're using 1x1 one one bricks or plates in which case you'll also have the dark gray leaking through and pretty much cracks on all sides which is cool when you're doing things like a turtle shell which you'll see at the end but basically another cool thing about this is because the studs are actually further apart than they should be if it lined up diagonally with 2x2, two two, the distance has the studs clutching themselves. You'd be surprised that this is actually a pretty strong grip and is very useful when considering and building a lot of mocks. So try it out at home, tell me what you think, and yeah, look forward to seeing what you guys build with it. 